Greetings. I'm Hellhound, and it looks like the Christmas season is upon us once again. And uh, what better way to celebrate than to watch some scary movies? Um, and today, I'm going to count down my top five favorite Christmas-themed horror films. Um, horror movies that either take place during Christmas or have an, ab uh, have an actual Christmas theme. I'm including both on this list. Um... So, uh, let's go ahead and get started. Number five, Jack Frost. Now, <laughs> I know what you're thinking. Um, there's a lot of better movies that probably could have been included in this list that I didn't include in this list. Uh, better Watch Out, Christmas Evil, To All a Good Night. But for variety's sake, I had to include this one because it's a killer snowman. I mean, come on. You gotta love it. It's, how can you go wrong with that? Killer snowman. Short answer, you can't. Jack Frost. I've already reviewed this on my channel, so check out that review if you haven't already. Um, it's a really, really fun movie. It's stupid as hell, but it's a guilty pleasure. It's so bad, it's good. It's ridiculous in every way, and there's a sequel that's even more ridiculous and over the top. So yeah, check it out. <laughs> You'll have a blast. Next is Gremlins, an actual good movie. Um, a very good movie, directed by Joe Dante. Um, and I think this is his finest hour, actually. I think this is the best thing he's ever done. I mean, this or the Howling. Um, it's a close one. But, um, yeah, Gremlins. Love those little little monsters. Um, this is a really fun movie as well. And uh, I think there's some moments that are genuinely suspenseful, too. It's not just uh, straight comedy. It's, um, there's uh, some genuine horror as well. Some, some uh, scares to be had in this one, actually, um, you wouldn't expect. Um, it's not like the second movie, which is just a straight-up silly. This one's actually... Um, a horror movie, hence being on this list. But yeah, Gremlins. If you haven't seen this already, do yourself a favor and check it out. Next is Krampus. I was very, very pleased with this movie. Um, I thought this was uh, very, very enjoyable. It has a very cynical attitude towards the holiday season. And um, it fits the film like a glove. And Krampus himself is really, really scary. Um, really frightening to look at. And is uh, kind of kept in the shadows. He's more mysterious. And it's done in such a way that uh, his kind of his minions do most of the the killing and whatnot, all the the havoc, all the carnage. But yeah, this is a very fun movie, and uh, it's pretty scary too. It's it's the best of both worlds. It's kind of a horror comedy, but it balances both uh, equally and does excels at both. Uh, in those genres. It's not many movies can boast of that, in my opinion. But this one does it just right. Krampus. Check it out. It's from the director of uh, Trick or Treat as well, so do that what you will. I knew I'd be in for a good time with that movie, and I sure was. I was very, very, very satisfied. Alright, next. You know this had to make the list. Silent Night, Deadly Night. A Killer Santa. How can you go wrong? Um... Yeah. Very, very good movie. It's um, interesting because we actually get to see the origin of the killer. We get to see what he goes through as a child, how he becomes the way he is. Um, why he's, well, why he's the way he is. Um, and uh, and it's pretty, pretty cool the way they did it. The second half is kind of the standard slasher fare. Just a generic body count movie, but uh, still very enjoyable, for sure. Um, I highly recommend this one. Um, it's very good. And definitely get this particular release from Scream Factory. They did a great job on it. Includes the uncut version as well. Um, and, uh, and of course, has some great special features, too. So definitely, that's definitely the version to have if you can own this movie. Silent Night Deadly Night, a must-have. And definitely check out the Silent Night Deadly Night Part 2 as well. Garbage Day, that movie is hilarious. And the number one movie to watch around Christmas time, that's uh, horror anyway, is Black Christmas. While everybody's watching Rudolph and Frosty and Elf, I'm watching Black Christmas. This movie has it all. This movie does everything right. It just came out in 1974. It's one of the first slasher films I can think of. Um, judging by Bob Clark, <laughs> and, um, yeah, some very creative kills, a very mysterious killer, 
Um, some great acting, some good characters. John Saxon's in it. Uh, Margaret Kidder's in it. Um, yeah. Uh, I have nothing bad to say about Black Christmas. I think it's perfect. I think it's a flawless masterpiece. It's the best Christmas themed horror film for many, many reasons. I've already reviewed this, so I won't go into too much detail. Check out my review for more info. Black Christmas. My number one favorite movie to watch, my favorite horror movie to watch during the Christmas season. Hi right, guys, well that was my top five. Please feel free to leave your um, top five in the comments below, or better yet, make your own video. Tell them Hellhound sent you. Um, you can consider this a tag video if you want. Um, also check out my um, top five Halloween themed horror films, which I did uh, a couple months ago. Um, so, uh, so yeah, I hope everybody has a good Christmas. Um, let me know some of the cool stuff you get and when uh, when the 25th gets here. Let me know some of your what your favorite present is and, and whatnot. Let me know if you had a enjoyable time with your family. Um, Alright guys, I'm Hellhound. Thank you for watching. Until next time, Merry Christmas.